Hey YouTube, popcorn. Man, it's been a while since I made a video. But today, I want to introduce my new project. This is a 19, well, let's look on the uh, old VIN number here. It's a 1981 Yamaha GT 50. I picked this thing up a couple weeks ago from a neighbor and he advised me that it hasn't ran in almost 20 years. He doesn't know anything about it except that his dad bought it, rode it once, and then it sat in the backyard. This guy's been my neighbor for 20 years and I never knew he had this. If I'd known he had this earlier, I would have probably been bugging him about it. But for his kindness, he uh, sold this to me really, really cheap. I didn't know if the motor was blown or what. All he said is that it ran one time and then his dad put it away and it's been sitting there ever since. So, this is my new project. This has taken place of Big Butt Becky, my Yamaha TW200. So I named this one Little Becky. And this right here, Ice of Hell, is uh, my daughter Brooks' third book she wrote. So that's the title of the book. You can find it on Amazon. Just type in Ice of Hell. If you want an autographed copy, you can DM me and I'll make sure you get one. So my plan is to restore this, make a couple videos. And uh, the good news is I did get it running. Oh, by the way, it didn't have a key so first and foremost I had to figure out how am I gonna get a key for this bloody thing so this key here is a spare key it's a Yamaha key that I had made for Big Butt Becky which I no longer have I don't know if I told you that or not I sold it a couple weeks ago to a very nice gentleman here in town so I gave him all the original keys and I used this key to repin this ignition. So now she turns on, operates like it should. Ah, oh. what time man, my new tire, thank you. There it is, my new tire for the front. I already did the back. <laughs> Trying to find tires for this little bike is freaking hard. But I picked this one up, got it on sale. Tick. I think I got it from JP Cycles for like 23 bucks. And it's uh 70 by 90 by 14. So now I'm in the process of taking the front tire off. Gonna mount it. But back to the ignition. So I was able to get the ignition rekeyed. I had to take all this off. Take the ignition out. Oh, by the way, this is a two-stroke. Front part here is gasoline. The rear is a two-stroke oil. 
Now hopefully it'll start. Turn that niche that there. One, two. Oh, almost. There it is. Lost count was it five kicks? It's a little cold, so that was a cold start. One of the main problems with it, changed out the ignition coil, put a new spark plug. All the cables were seized. Every single freaking cable on here was seized. The lights were. Our brand was completely gummed up with old gasoline and two stroke oil in there. I mean, it was the worst carburetor I've ever seen. Took it out, cleaned it up, put the lines, the fuel filter, and probably after I resettled it, three or four kicks in this big fire right up. Shaft driven. So my plan, once I get it up and running good, I think I want to tear it all down and clean it up and make it look brand new. I haven't really decided yet, but this is my new project, my 1981 Yamaha QT50. Like and subscribe. Later. Oh, have a good Thanksgiving.